Hello folks and welcome back to Compton Farm for our 10,000 cow challenge and last time we got up to 7,000 cows of our 10,000 cow goal. However, I am taking a diversion from all that because I can see on top right we bought a lot of my 3.6 mil. Because yeah, I'll stab things off the camera just doing bits so you know that and yeah. 7,000 cows gets you a lot of manure, slurry and milk so what I've gone done is done a fair few things so starting off with so go up to our cow pastures and that so for example here I think it's been like what a month and that maybe not even that and already we've got 350,000 years of slurry 158,000 years of manure which is a is a pain in the ass to deal with that because yeah you've got this pole here See, it's almost overflowing pretty much. But yeah, the problem is, is get some like a tractor in here with a the forest pickup and then have the trailer to you know scoop it out. Because yeah, I like to use a large trailer net. However, my thinking is going to be with these going for this, have a tractor that comes into here with the forest pickup, maybe get a small tractor net. Uh, yeah, something a bit more light and nimble, just to see if we can get it in, then have a second tractor, let's say along this side here. Oh, look at that little cow laying down its manure. Oh, look at you. Getting sidetracked. <laughs> and yeah, so... Yeah, so that fills up. Also, I'm starting to feed the cows um, TMR. Because yeah, we do have one beef stable, so yeah, these ones here, the Angus's. I did just put TMR in because at the moment we're making too much money in that. But yeah, I want to do things now. I want to get our own TMR being produced in that. So I've gone and installed a mod. So yeah, the Solicane Static Line by, I think it's DD Mod Passion, I think it is. And look at that, 10 million litres we can have here. Yeah, we could do pig food. Or we could do either do. So two mixed rations, Solicane. Satellite feeding premium. I'm not sure what's the difference in that. Ah, wait a minute. Feet that's already got. Don't tell me that's already got TMR in it. If that's the case, then I don't do. I want to get something like that. So, 10 million or a million years. I think 10 million years is going to be the goal for us. And then we need a transporter. So, I have got. No idea how this works because, yeah, when Ozzy this came out, I was able to do the mod review of this at the time, so I'll go and purchase that. But, yeah, so out of all that, we got a load of digestive cells, so we got 750,000 litres on top with another 257. That's just from the biogas plants, you know, transport all that manure and server. Oh, yeah, some of it was also some of the excess hay we had for the note I purchased it. I think it was about what, a million litres of hay in that, but trust me. In this episode, we got a lot of moan to do because, yeah, I did think about ripping up all the fields in that because we have a look. Uh, look at lime. Most of our fields needs lime. Plowing. Most of our fields needs plowing. So, yeah, we're going to get that yield bonus in that, ideally, but. For the time being, I think we're going to be looking rather good, so, yeah, all of our grass fields is ready to go. But yeah, so we got some fields we're going to be purchasing, so, what's coming up for the next episode now? So, field 1, 13, and 17 is going to be ready, so I'm thinking what we can do is start purchasing these fields now. And then from there, these fields can be used as a good source of straw or just general AFLs we want. So, yeah, we're going to get a lot of money from this. Like, that is a million years of digestate. And at the moment, how much is digestate going for? I have just the economy sentence as well, just so we can get our loan paid off. So, yes, a million years. So, that's going to be very substantial, Nat. Do tell me what... I think I should have done the math in my head. Is that 10 million we're going to get? Fast case then, purchase all these fields. 
Okay, not quite there yet. And there we go. That's still going. That's empty. Yeah, that's empty. So yeah, we're left over with how much? Half a mil, give or take. But at least that. So what I've got done is purchase a tanker and that. Ooh, okay. Okay, what I'm going to do is remove that rock picker because, again, last episode I had everything set up for a live stream and that, or preparing things for a live stream and that. And how does this go? So, unfold. So, I'm guessing we have to load this on somehow. So, I think what we need to do is fold this up and get this load on. Perhaps, so if I go to the other bank account, I'm guessing that's how it works, right? I know you could probably use a forklift in that, but since I got a tight hander here with a big grab or big what was it big back grab or whatever it's called in that, so the spout wants to be on this side, so literally hook up as it is and then reverse. Man, this is actually nice, it's like I totally missed when I saw the mod dropping out, and yeah, I saw it on the mod hub, and I didn't really think of too much of it. So, I'm guessing, just go piece off bang. Ah, there we go. I'm sure that's probably a way of snapping it on now that like you need to drive up to it, but. You know what, that I am rather happy with, so. There we go, got our baby. So, unfold the mixer wagon. Oops. Okay, oh. Ah, so. Ah, that's going to be a problematic now. Uh, bear me a sec while I get this all properly hooked up, because I think I'm doing something wrong here, like, you know, transported in. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, I think I'm doing something wrong here. Ah, right, yeah, I sort of see how it works now. So, yeah, I didn't need that. So, literally. Yep, the trailer unfolds and all sorts of scoops up and that. Fair enough, so... What I'm going to do for now is leave that here by the store and that, because... That will come in handy later on. But yeah, for now what we need to do is, yeah, just a bit of farming and that, so... Yeah, we just made a lot of money from that digest date, so... We're in May, so... We do have our clothes sell, you know, the clothes by Field 20 on the left. We got a bunch of those to sell that, so I'll grab the lorry for that. But then, yeah, so, take this, actually, what I think what I'll do is, get a worker to take this to the field, so, and to get this one sprayed, so I'm thinking, perhaps, say, go up here. There we go. Okay, fine, just go into the field. And then, yeah, what I want to do is grab the lorry, reset you, and sort of trailer over there. Yes, it is. So, yeah, what I want to do is get this all properly set up. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's already set up for pallets and that, so that makes life so much easier than that. So, yeah, I think we'll just grab the clothes and then we'll yeah, do a little quick sell. And yeah, no, this is Bell, so this will need reconfiguration. Of course, you've got our handy little toolbox here, just for the occasion, so... Pallets also load, yes please. And let's grab those clothes. And there we go, so see here we've got a bunch of pallets of clothes, and all these pallets are 2,990 litres each, so... Yeah, I think we'll get a fair bit loaded up here, so... Loading area, yes, please. Because, yeah, I want to... Yeah, I think it's going to take at least two sections here. And maybe even more, because that's already 20,000 years. And, yeah, 
Yeah, I think he's going to make me do a full load of this. Come on, where, where are these going on? Come on. load up and then we'll see how much we have afterwards because yeah, for some reason some of these do not want to go on. Because of where it's all leveled and that on the ground, so I'm not sure. So right, we have hit that 90,000 litre maximum no hold, so what we're going to do is all the other little bits. Unfortunately this you can just go boom and then shrunk it down, so we're going to have a bit extra, so yeah, a lot of this is just end pieces here and there. Yeah, 90,000 litres of clothes. That is a lot of clothes. I think this has been going on, what, for a couple of months at least now. So, yeah, we'll get these clothes sold out. Actually, where are we going to be taking these to? So, we have a look. Oh, where are prices for clothes? So, they've gone too far. Close, close, where are you to? So, best place. Yeah, okay, we're just at the tail end of it also. Farmer's Market, Garden Center, so if we can. Yeah, just take it to the Garden Center on the road from here. And then, yeah, just a little hole, I think, because. Yeah, I'm not a fat round. But, free craft for 90 plus thousand years, so. A good payday for us, so overall that is a hundred thousand a year, so that is a lot. Three grand for a thousand a year, so three hundred thousand, three million we're gonna get from this. Fun again, is that, is that my math wrong? Three million quid we're gonna get from this. Yep, do not lose that. That is sixty grand includes just there alone. Yep, the economy in that is very good in that, so we can use this to pay off the loan as well, because yeah, we've got a three million pound loan. But yeah, I want to use that money for getting access to this area over here and that, so now what we can do over here is put our last cow pens down, so there we go, first load of clues. Dang it. But yeah, so what I say? Yeah, three million quid and the rest, please. There we go. So yeah, I think that is a lot of moolah. That is, yeah, basic clues from the greenhouses, so. Yeah, I think we've broken the economy here, that is for sure. And the last little bit. Yeah, that is literally just over three mil we got, so... Uh, lovely jubbly. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Can't forget that thousand pounds. I say thousand pounds, but obviously we're being on... Doing other things is on dollars. So yeah, now we're back to the pound dollar dues, pound dues. So yeah, I think at the moment money's not going to be an issue for us. So really now it's just a case of getting everything cracking on. But again, a lot of the legwork with you know comes with the transport of sorry and all that. That is a lot of effort. And I wish they would go into the manure plates and that, but do I sacrifice the grass field for a manure plate? I think I may do actually, because even if there's just some of that manure that goes in, one, it adds capacity in that, and two, it just makes my life a hell of a lot easier. Got all this grass field over here, we don't need it, I don't think so. I think I'm going to go to soil extensions. And there we go, we've got a manure heap. Is it manure heap? Or no, is it silos or silo extensions? No, don't a bunker silo. No. 
in the hay shed or anything like that. And there's all a big old bunker silo. Thinking, what's give us a go? Worst case scenario, it doesn't work, then you know what? Fair enough. See, so I think one there, one there. And then, oh, this is going to be a tricky one. Oh, yeah, f uh, where, where to? So, yeah, it's got to be there, right? Yeah, it's got to be there for that one, and... See, so yeah, that's the three new ones we put down. And if we go back to the main farm... See, so yeah, I did put one down... Ooh. Oh, yeah, this was something else I'd done. But yeah, look at that in the sec, so... I put one down here, but I'm not sure what that's collecting, so again, so many places where this could go, potentially. Uh thinking there. Downside it just doesn't work properly. It's like you can't uh finagle it. That kinda of sucks, but yeah, that's another thing I did was also helping the money that get a bunch of apple orchards to where the old BJ was and yep put them into six um <laughs> apple tree productions by Mr. Somatona so that is all cracking away so we're gonna need more combines than that so what I'm gonna do is save the game just in case we get a game crash because yeah something like that will and as and has has happened oh sorry that piece is making a bong noise because of Adobe in that for whatever reason but yeah, I think, you know what, after all that excitement and that, you know, breaking the banking system, because, yeah, <laughs> let's just look at our finances. How much we got in products, old products, one and a half mil. Yeah, we are making a lot of money here, so, but yeah, what if I want to double check, we actually are putting Florida down, and yes, we are, so... Again, maybe a spreader with a self-propelled sprayer, or not self-propelled sprayer, but what's the word I'm looking for? A distributor and that would be better. Because yeah, we've got a couple of pylons here we need to navigate in that. Oh yeah, at the end of the day, is this worth doing? Probably need to craft scale things. No, eh? Probably not, no. Absolutely not, but you know what? Screw it, fuck it. We're doing it, so... But yeah, once it gets done... I want to get the mowing on the way. We do have a mower released out. But I think, yeah, with our money situation at the moment, we can afford a couple more mowers. Uh, maybe just a tad. And actually, speaking of fertilizing, yeah, all of our fields are fully fertilized, which is good. But yeah, I think, you know what? Screw this. We need a Distributor one, so do I have any? You no, know, I don't have any self propelled ones of those, like the John Deere one, so fair enough. I'm thinking, frick it, let's go with the Kabuta one. Yep, see, so yeah, no, let's put you over here. I'll go grab the other one. So much easier doing the spray than that. I don't know why they went with it in the first place, but you know, it is what it is, Nat. And there we go, we are spraying. Also, I spent money on some new mowers, so what I've got done is I bought two new mowers. Also, I did purchase a small John Deere tractor now for see if we can use that to help us, you know, with the whole uh what's the word um neural connected situation, so that's got narrow tires, it's a small frame tractor, so I touch wood that will work, but who knows to be honest, so that is on its way. Workers and that I have left them to their own devices, so because yeah, we're gonna do this and then I'm thinking of doing something a bit different, you know, so bathing as your usual, but I'm going to use the new variable pickup in that. Or do we do 
the forge wagon one and using the variable pickup. Yeah, I know we've got those and that. However, yeah, I think you're using the variable pickup ones. So at least with that, I can have the slight adjustment to, you know, not go unrealistic stupid and that, but just big enough and that. Or do I say, heck it, just do it as it is, and then click the bells, and then we you know, use the bells to put it into that fermenter silo. I think we do that instead. And these will be realistic sized bells, not, you know, super dense bells and that, so... Oh, I'm going to already regret my choices here, so... Frig it, so... Yep, yeah, no, let's go with a Cronat. Ah, yeah, we want 245-ish horsepower. Because, yeah, I'm looking forward to do the bathing now. It's going to take me hours to do, but... You know what? Frig it, so... 245 I want. Do I want a Massey or do I want a New Holland? I'm... To be honest, I don't think I've gone with New Holland. Massey's now gone with occasionally in that. But never in New Holland, so... I'm going to sort that there a sec, because... Yeah... Yeah, maybe a large tractor and that. But yeah, do I have the new Holland one on here? So, no I don't. And yeah, I've got the 8R series mod. whoop do you do in that? Or just go with a good old Massey in that. Actually, well, I think I'll go with the new Holland. As long as that one's got enough horsepower. 245 we need. Oh yes, so... I think that's going to be the short wheel base. I oh, know, I thought we had a short wheel on the wheel base version. I know there's a different variant that does that, so Michelin's... No, no, I don't want twins in that. Maybe some larger tires in that. You know what, something like that. Why not? Do I want the weights? Uh, not really. Fenders... Being extended ones, yes please. Wind film, window film, you know what? Keep that. Reverse beep, yes. Extra lights, please. 900 or 540E, I think 900's better. GPS, sure. Front loader, nope. But yeah, I think yeah, number one. Ooh, we can actually change the blue, so I think yeah, the blue power that is nice. Wait, I think we go black out on the rims. That is nice, so is that front weight? Ah right, so yep. The nine hundred is just the weights and that so there we go, see so yeah, EU So you got the US spec, yeah, and yeah, so that was just the weight on the front. Yeah, I don't want a weight. Yeah, just keep it simple. Let's put a little bit of weight on it. Just a small weight. And yeah, so that is all of that done. Now we'll just check on our worker, so... This worker is going to start off over here. We've got one on field 5, and one on 25 that hasn't gone. So maybe you got that one set to transport and that. So, nah, fair enough. Easy done in that. So you yeah, have widespread in. Swath dropping, please. And yeah, something like this would be a lot better if it was done my way in terms of know using well you do a header or two before progressing but yeah I got so many pieces of equipment now what's our slot count at uh yeah so another 800 or so slots left but yeah fiends are already very uh, loose with the frames and that but yeah with the variable pickup so yeah obviously we're going to be doing the largest size possible 
so default extended or bonus pickup would do just fine. I'm not going to do the virtual wind rover like you know, the stupid unrealistic gnat. But yeah, that looks nice. Nice new Holland. Yeah, frame rate 2. Yeah, I am definitely pushing the limits on last gen on this game save here because, yep, there are times where I could just leave the game running, you know, not do anything at all, just let it run in the background, and next you know, within an hour, the game will crash. But, so there we go, so Jarrative's been added. See so yeah, that? Well, there is a nice canoe field over here. Oh, how much is that? So is that, yeah, 600 grand. Is that right tomorrow? No, that's still some times away. And yet, yeah, so... That was just set to, you do know, Do its own thing. Swap dropping, yes please. And, yeah, so... Bits I will need to do in that. Because, yeah, my plan is get all these collected and... Actually, I don't think I've got said production down. I was on about the fermenter and that. Well, no, I do, yep, somewhere, must be. Ah, uh, yeah, I know where it is. We got it up here. No, not that. There we go, the custom fermenting silo. Because, yeah, we can do is then put some grass in there. Also, do we want a dryer? Because we want hay, we want silage, and we'll need straw. Have I got down a dryer? Ooh. Use a farm factory. But no, I don't use a farm factory because that could potential cock up with other things I've got already running. Need a hood. Uh, tea factory net? No. I've got a dryer. To be fair, it's been a while since I've used a dryer net, so... By the end of the day, I need to figure out actually how much we're going to get, like... The bell limit is going to be well broken here. 200 large bells. And yet, we can just, like, you know, skipping across. We're getting lag spikes and that, so... Yeah, there will be maybe a lot of cuts where, maybe not so much in the main bulk of this, but what I mean is, you know, we'll suddenly skip to the next segment, for example. Oh, I forgot to knock, knock, knock my mic there, so, yeah, but I am waffling on now, so, I think what I'm just going to do is chat for a bit, and yeah, so what I need to do now is just do a bit of farming than that, you know. Sorry for the, the episode with, you know, sending everything and you know, making multi millions. Now it's just time to take a notch down, just relax a bit. And yeah, just relax. And yeah, just do a bit of farming. Yep, another lag spike, so. Oh, God forbid, so. Yeah, it's going to be plenty of these, so... Like, even that bit there, just going across and pressing save. That was a good two, three seconds a day, so... I am pushing to them with slot counts, with productions and that, especially have everything so super dense put down. But anyways, I have waffled and all, <laughs> all long, long enough, so... I'm going to chill out for a bit, because, yeah, it's currently what? Two o'clock in the morning here. I want to watch a bit of Mississippi Peanuts. Watch on Chaspo. Is it Spakuva? Spakuvo? Whatever it is. Uh, yeah, well, yeah, catch up a couple of episodes on that. And yeah, so chill out, farm, and relax. And yeah, we'll come back when we're doing the bell collecting, I think. See, so, yeah, our feet are already missing bits on the edges. Uh, yes, we are.
And alright, we are finally done. So yeah, did these a automatic bell loader because there was no chance in hell I was gonna manually either stack these with a tank hander or use the uh what's it, the Anderson one that can sort of lift it up and out onto the trader, so just show you what I'm on about. Yeah, that one there, so something like that. No chance in hell I was gonna do that. Especially with that. 873 bells we've done. That is my biggest hole in bells at all. Not quite a thousand bells, but uh, close to 900 and that. So, oh yeah, so we got 900 bells pretty much, almost. Top of that, we got a lot of grass because, yeah, because with the fermenter side on that, they needed loose grass, so I was like, fuck's sake, lovely net. But I remembered, I had a silo here that's storing the pay dirt, which actually is glad because I think a lot of these productions here have run out of stones and pay dirt and that, so yeah, that we'll get on to another time. But at the moment, I'm not too worried about that, so that is the last of that going in. Also, I did sell off the, uh, what's it? Mowers and that, so get rid of you. Keep you, keep you, Nat. Think, did we even finish off the fertilizing? Oh, I'm not sure, Nat. So, we have a look 5.8 million liters of grass. So, that could be slightly ditch, Nat. I do think that is my biggest hole ever because I'm trying to think in, um, oh, we have what's it? Uh, i trying to think of the map, No Man's Land, my Safari Challenge, Nat. That I did, that. Done a lot. Also, Court Farm. I did two million liters of silage in that, and two million of straw in one episode in that. So, I think that's my biggest hole ever in that. That's from all the fields in that. So, yeah, some fields yielded more than others. Obviously, things like 24, that was not fertilized at all. So, that was my bad. So, actually, going to fertilize in uh, close enough. So, just a little bit that needs to do now. Yeah, also, whilst I'm here, just checking if these moss dropped today, so... Because, yeah, ah, no, no moss dropped today. Moss dropped on PC and that today on Wednesday, but no, so yeah. Obviously, since last time, I did get stressed, I did, because... Uh, yeah, I was getting to the point after about two hours after I was getting to about four in the morning, I was like, just falling asleep here a bit, so... I was like, yeah, I need some sleep, so... That is that done. And really, now all I need to do is get the worker off on, well, furrows in the grass fields. Because, yeah, hey, after all that, we need to furrows all these fields again, so that is lovely. Can hours of work, and in terms of game crashes and that, I've had one noticeable game crash that means, meant I lost about an hour and a half of work. So yeah, funny enough, I was before I went to bed and that, so that's why I thought, fuck it, like, hour and a half lost straight away. Oh, yeah, I am not doing that again. Also, yeah, New Holland, I just swap out for the base game, the large one, because, yeah, the other one just had a turbo wine or noise and that, just, when you got headphones on and that, yeah, it was like, just earpiece, earpiece, uh, piercing, piercing. I don't get me wrong, I suffer from tonight as I do from a, my motorcycle accident and that, but that, it was just like, just, oh, I can't describe it. It's that one out of the New Holland T7000 I got, so, but yeah, motors sold, so two and a half hours each, well, two hours to two and a half hours. Just with what else we got on the market, nothing to look at. But yeah, now I need to figure out a way to dry the grass, so since I last seen you folks, I did saw a good old favour because yeah, things got like the farm factory net, and I think also okay, that one does do it. But the one by uh, DS Power do have a hay one, but again, that is a very low capacity in that. So I was thinking of what I could I use? So the one I could find that doesn't have any other recipes involving potatoes or any other crops in that is the grass dryer here. So. My thinking is we give up some of this space here, so... 
Okay, I'm thinking if we say do... Okay, if I get you aligned... Let me just go... One... Shit. Ah, uh, we've hit the production limit, so... Which is not surprising because of all these apple trees I've got here and that, so... One, two, three, four, five. That would do. So yeah, because I want the grass dryer. Things like the apple trees is a good side income in that. We are making money in that on the hour, so... Whatever costs I am sustaining at the moment, it's not going to impact us, so... So I feel like that's one, two... Can I get three? It's going to be super tight. There we go, so yeah. That should be fine, I may have to move that. Yeah, we're getting a lot of manure from there anyway, so... You know what, that I am happy with. And since here we've got 3.2 mil at the moment, let's go and grab the landscaping tool, level. There we go, just level it out a little bit in that, so... Just makes the transit transaction or transition a bit more smoother. I think I'm thinking, since we've got, was that asphalt? Yes, so... It's a big old asphalt flat here. There we go. Just try to blend everything in like so. Lovely jubbly. Cause yeah, now it's looking a lot better and Yeah, I know they're gonna dry too much. I think they dry what? About three hundred thousand litres per month, which normally not a problem. Yeah, three sixty now, so that's going to take a while to deal with, so fair enough. But yeah, I'll not stay. I do want to be distributed to the other fermenter net, so... Yeah, we've got 5.8 million here, so... Let's go and grab our trader, so... And that one there, 10 million years. Oh, nice! It's just over here, so... I think that's got our straw in, so we get... what? Yeah, we need about half and half, I think, for the mixer wagon. Because, yeah, ideally we want more hay in that, because hay is less valuable in that, so... But, yeah, I think we've got a lot of straw in here already, haven't we? Well, no, not a lot of straw, but this is a 10 meter capacity, so... Yeah, 241,000 here, so yeah, still a lot of straw. My meat. Okay, yeah, not a lot of shorts gonna go in. How is our animals doing at the moment? I have topped them up recently in that, in between episodes and that. So, yeah, do not too bad. 40,000 litres of slurry, fucking hell. Okay, also, we've got milk and that we can do with collecting. And yeah, from that, what we can do is. Oh, uh, what's it? Oh, no. I don't want to put a straw in there. We've gone the wrong way, so we can snoof around. But yeah, I think yeah, I want that grass to be done and that ready and that to go. But yeah, also I want to sk skip ahead see how much money we can make just from the milk and all that. But no, I think we'll wait until next time. So I think next time what we'll do is live stream. I know I said it for the essential was going to be this episode and that, but thinking having an episode on, you know, just breaking the bank makes all the sense, so let's get this backed up. So, yeah, we got 5.8 mil, so I only want 2.5, 2.9 mil or so in here. Yeah, things I've got pay dirt as well. What a million years of pay dirt. So yeah, let me fill this up a sec, and then I'll see you folks in a second. And there we go, we are done, and yeah, light, the lighting has changed a little bit, that's because... Yeah, I was going to change it just to match the sort of outro here a little bit, just sort of as we wrap things up, I think. But then I realised I had it set to, what, early spring in that, or sorry, mid-winter now, so... 
Yeah, turn it off. So now we have a look. Uh, yeah, fixed visual month that is off because yeah, I think it was before it was uh, March or April. So yeah, it was like this. It was, but now we got our daylight back. So worker B is blocked. So what are you blocked by? I don't know. I'm just gonna reset that. Yeah, that's got fertilizer now that and part seed in it. By the way, we've got 3.2 mil, so a couple of grand here and there at the moment. Not too worried about. But yeah, so let's get rid of that help menu. We do have free mil. We can clear the loan. We can pay off the loan now. Actually, how much manure is in here as well? 13,000 litres. Maybe it's just excess in that or fairly distributed, I'm not sure, but. But yeah, we've got free mail. Really, what do we want to do with the money? That's the thing. We need to figure out a way to use this money in that because, as the old saying goes, use it or lose it. So, yeah, things like new land potentially. But at the moment, there's really nothing left to plant. And yeah, we've got way too much. Hey. Yeah, a bit much there. Yeah, hear all that all roaring to life. See, so yeah, 250,000 litres and it does 360,000 litres a month. So that's going to be about a mil, as I mentioned. But yeah, what can we do with some more? Because I want to get the silage in that, or not silage, the TMR being produced from like next month for that. Because, yeah, I want to, one, to get the fields for right, so, at the moment, field three is done, workers soon field five, so, yeah, that should take us no more than, what, an hour or two to do? Because, yeah, things like 13 and 30 now, they're all fine. But, yeah, again, so, what do we do to money, because, production-wise, we're at our limit, almost, so, because... Maybe self-sufficient, but that's just more of a need, like more just a thing to do in that. Not so much a thing we need here on the farm. Things like yeah, the farm factory that would be absolutely nice. But yeah, how I got things worked out. There are new stuff now, I think, in the farm factories and that. But yeah, so yeah, you sort of see I've got a bunch of TMR mixing buildings because I thought, yeah, let's use a bunch of those. The good old fermenting silo. But yeah, really. Make our own digestates. Oh no. Make our own fertilizer. So that for a profit. But again, it's just do things for the sake of profit more than anything else. Yeah, that is full. No time that is full. Pretty sure this does have a high output now, a high throughput, so... 48,000, so that is... 480, 4.8 mil, so yeah, it's just a low capacity. But yeah, high output, so we've already got 4,000 litres of signage, so... All of this is looking good. And yeah, again, let's look at our cows and that, so... These ones aren't producing milk because, yeah, these are brown Swiss. So, yeah, this one here, I think it's our new one. So, look at brown Swiss. What if I got a f oh, yeah, I bought a thousand calves. I did, didn't I? Because I thought I was going to be too sure on how much I could be producing money wise. But now I am regretting my choices here. So, do we get rid of these and get new ones in? I think at the moment I'll hold off, because, yeah, I'll we'll just see how everything goes, but... Again, 100,000 years, 200,000 years here and there. Yes, I know some of these are mixed together in that, but things like the milk... That is not a lie, so... I think what I'll do is... I think to wrap things up. Things like I'll, I'll save it for the live stream now, because... Yeah, currently it's Wednesday night, just going to wrap this up, so I guess edited and all that. That, along with the next episode of Rags to Riches, will be up tomorrow, or today as this is going out, then yeah, do a live stream. 
Because, yeah, I've got nothing on tomorrow at the moment. It's not working, unfortunately, being laid off at the end of the month. But, uh, yeah, that is that. That's a whole different thing there, so... Anything in the used market? No, yeah, no, not really. But, yeah, let me each have a full sec on what to do. Get things planned out, then we'll wrap things up. So right, what I got done was, again, buy some more new equipment, so I bought a brand new tractor, a new 80 meter drill, but no the other one we had and I reset it was a 12 meter one. Also got a jack tail unit port, so that's going to be our lime spreader. But yeah, it's getting dark in that, so what I'm going to do is be a bit cheeky in that. Because yeah, we're in May. I swap it to June, so we should have a bit more daylight left. Even if it's just like another hour or so, that will do us just fine. I think that's going to be as best as we can get, so... You know what, let's go purchase one more field, so this will cost us just under half a mil. Oh yeah, in terms of what to be drilling here, I'm thinking grass or sorghum. Sorghum, actually, I think we can do because then we can get a... Another crop that produces straw. Actually, no, sorghum doesn't produce straw, doesn't it? No, that's a grain. So, we could do corn, get maize in November. And actually, no, we could get maize around September time, I think. Actually, I'm thinking, what heck is Let's just do grass. So, this would be another grass field. Actually, no, let's do corn now, because yeah, I want to yeah, get, get a bit more silage potentially, but do something a bit different. Yeah, I think we did to make silage at the start of the series. I think... Did we have 13 and 30 in that at the start of the series in that? I can't remember in that, or... Was that my original Let's Play? I know my original Let's Play on... Well, my first series in that on Constant. We did have that section, but here... I'm not sure, so... Yeah, because we could do soybeans... Yeah, that's right, but we need to wait a year to harvest, not harvest to sell that. That is maximum profit, but I think at the moment we're five for profit. Still got two million pounds left. I really, yeah, just the canoe fields, the other rye fields. Yeah, a lot of farmers have done right now. And those, it's no diverse in terms with, you know, having barley, wheat, oats and that. <laughs> All gone pretty, uh, very samey samey. Actually, no, it's not right, ain't it? No, barley. Yeah, it's barley. What was he rying at? Think of another map that's got rye on it. Court farm, maybe? Nah, eh, I don't know. But anyway, so we're gonna get this plowed. Stones and that. How big are they? Are they the large ones or tiny ones? Tell you one, so I'm going to forget about these. But yeah, so let's go and get this done, and I'll see you folks afterwards once we are done here.
alright. It's been a while since we first seen each other, I think. Recently it's been at least a week and that since I've done the last recorded segment, so I've just been busy and that doing a few things here and there. Also, I've got a lot of the pre prep work done, so if we look at our plan requirements, so every field has been ploughed, I'm pretty sure of. Yeah, fruit free, I'm not too fussed about yeah, whatever. Lime wise, I think we need lime on actually no lime's all done in that. Fertilising, some of it will need doing in that, which is fair enough. But yeah, not everything's been drilled with grass and that, so for example, sixteen and actually yeah, five of the yeah, so five, three, six, sixteen, that's been drilled. So you need to drill the rest of twenty five. 29 and then 24. Obviously the grass is already growing in some parts that we haven't ploughed. So yeah, the ploughing that took a while to do that. And yeah, I was like working throughout the night now, and next you know, bam, mid like that. Did not realise. Yeah, I spent what, a good couple of hours now just ploughing, getting all the fields drilled and prepped and that. And then yeah, somehow, <laughs> yeah, lost track of time in. Yeah, midnight came, so that's instantly where I started growing, so I was like, fuck's sake. <laughs> At the end of the day, it is what it is, and that, and yeah. Yeah, apologize for the day this coming out. Just being swamped up with another, another, a number of things. Couldn't get some videos done on that. But, anyway, so I think next time what we we'll do is really see how much TMR we can make in that. Hopefully it's not like two weeks before the next episode comes out. Yeah, I really hope not. Actually, is this already been drilled in that? Yeah, again, oh, I forgot what parts I have done and haven't done. So yeah, if I go to my settings here, turn on my field info and all that other good stuff, not news. So yeah, grass is growing, so... Actually, no. Yep. Yeah. I've already drawn this bit here. Yeah, I've already done this bit, it's just the, this section over here, so I'll just sneak across here and that. But yes, next time we'll skip ahead a bit. Actually, no, we've got harvesting to do now, haven't we now? <laughs> so yeah, actually, how much have we got? So we got one, two, three, four, five fields to do. All of them are barley now, I think, is it? All barley, all five. Yeah, so barley's gonna get us a lot of straw in that. So, yeah, we'll skip ahead for a bit. So, yeah, next time it's gonna be a short episode and a lot easier to record than that. So, I'll go and get that done. But, yeah, so hopefully it's gonna be. I'm doing this bit now on Saturday the 26th. So, this should be out uh, over to or tomorrow night, hopefully, in that. Got nothing planned in that, so yeah, I think that's where we're going to leave it. And yeah, thinking things like these now, I'll do this off camera now, potentially in that. Yeah, this definitely needs to drill in that. But yeah, also, I've done some minor extensions here and there, you know, to get as much more grass as we can. Because yeah, we need the grass and the hay. Also, yeah, I forgot about the productions and that, so I've accidentally cocked up here a little bit, so sorry, straw, milk and that, so we'll get some of these transported as well, but yeah, what I fuck up was the silage and that, so if I go to our productions and that actually I think yeah, it's going to be a lot quicker if I just go over here and go boom so yeah, I accidentally had grass being made in that silage, which is not a problem However, I had that on accidentally to distribution and that, so yeah, guess where I went to? The BJ's and that, so yeah. So I decided to, you know what, fuck it, whack these on that, so that's on, that's on. So yeah, we'll get a bit of silage in that, processed. And yeah, let's go charge that, all get distributed. Me thinking that. In terms of digesting now, we don't have too much at the moment, but yeah, I'm not focusing on getting absolute millions now. That's how I got all those millions of millions was from getting size to be made, and then, yeah, just for fuck it. 
just skill processing that, so yeah. A lot of things I'm going to do off camera and that, so next episode, hopefully I'll try to get out by end of this coming week and that. And then, I'm thinking, yeah, after that, next episode is going to be against Shrew. Episode after that is the TMR net. And then I think the episode after that, yeah, if I make sure I make sure I write all these down, next up, the one after that is going to be achieving 10,000 cows and see is it possible to sustain the 10,000 cow farm on console? I think, yeah, I think 10,000 at the moment is going to be manageable in that. But what about an additional 30% increase now? Well, actually, it'd be almost like a 40, so 40, 50, almost percent increase, so. Yeah, that's going to be a lot in that, because you haven't done not, definitely haven't done the math yet. And even then, even if I do the math, there's variations on how the math is done in that. In terms of, do I just do it all based on cows that is 12 months or 80 months that? Because we do have cows of a variety of ages, so, for example, if we have a look, so, 10, 3, 15, 22, a few we've just seen. So yeah, all these is going to be a huge factor in that. Maybe if I do the lazy one, lazy one, do it based on 18 months or older in that. So yeah, I think different stages in our life, cows are super different, right? I know they do for a fact, I just can't remember the exact details on top of my head, but if I do some research in that, based on 18 months and plus then, Thinking actually that'd be a good way to you know, figure out how much teal more do we need in that. Or not the actual pens and that has an effect, I'm not too sure on that, but again, things I can keep track of, I know. So for example, say how much are these using per hour and that times that by twenty-four. So yeah, that's our monthly usage, and then from there obviously extrapolate. Ooh, fancy word there. And then yeah, figure out the rough estimate of how much we are and will need to have in terms of TMR because you yeah, do have that TMR mixing facility in that or mixing facility trailer in that so but anyways that's gonna leave it for today as always hope you enjoyed the episode if so special button feel free to comment below if you want to share so please be my guest if you're not subscribed to the channel yet so please consider but for to do hope you're gonna stay but for now it's be far more in stream and I'll see you all a very soon.